mettre. To put, to put. La clé, the key, the key. Où avez-vous mis les clés? Where did you put the keys? Right, where did you put the keys? Je ne me rappelle pas. I don't remember. <laughs> Good, I don't remember. <laughs> Et je ne me suis pas rappelé. I did remember. No. I, I, I didn't remember. Yes, once more. I didn't remember. I didn't remember. I didn't remember. Oublier se dit to forget. To forget. Forget s'écrit F-O-R-G-E-T. To forget. Avez-vous oublié Did you forget? Right. Did you forget? Non, je n'ai pas oublié. No, I didn't forget. No, I didn't forget. Comment dit-on vous oublierez? Um, you will forget. Good. You will forget. Non, je n'oublierai pas. Traction. I will not. I will not forget. I won't forget. Je n'oublierai pas. La traduction de jamais est never. Never. Never s'écrit N-E-V-E-R. Si vous voulez dire je n'oublierai jamais au lieu de dire I will not forget, dites I will never forget. I will never forget. Right. I will never forget. La contraction de I will est I'll. I'll never forget. Comment dit-on je ne le ferai pas? Um, I won't do it. Yes, I won't do it. Et si on dit I want to do it, ça veut dire quoi? Euh, je veux le faire. Je veux le faire. Oui, je veux le faire. Alors, once more. Je ne le ferai pas. I won't do it. I won't do it. Je ne le ferai jamais. I will never do it. Right. I will never do it. Ou bien, I'll never do it. Je ne comprends pas. I don't understand. I don't understand. Mm -hmm. Comment dit-on rien? Nothing. Nothing. Alors, je ne comprends rien. I don't understand nothing. Je ne comprends rien. On peut le dire de deux manières. I understand nothing. Ou au lieu de dire nothing, on peut signaler la négation avec I don't understand. Mais à ce moment-là, au lieu de nothing, il faut employer anything. Avec le signal don't, il faut dire anything au lieu de nothing parce qu'on ne peut pas signaler la négation deux fois, comme on le fait en français, n'est-ce pas Ne pas en français. En anglais, on ne peut pas faire cela. C'est-à-dire donc, une fois avec « don't » et une autre fois avec « nothing ». On dit « I understand nothing » ou « I don't understand anything ». C'est clair mm -hmm. uh, I don't understand uh, everything. Uh, no. Everything, c'est tout. Anything. Anything. Si vous employez don't, il faut dire rien, c'est-à-dire anything. Je ne vois pas. I don't see. Yes. Une seule négation. I don't see. Je ne vois rien. I don't see. Anything? Right. I don't see anything. Je n'ai pas vu. I didn't see it. No, je n'ai pas vu. Ah. I didn't see anything. Uh, I didn't see. Right. I didn't see. Je n'ai pas vu. I 
était ici. Mais je n'ai rien vu. I didn't see anything. Right, I didn't see anything. I didn't see anything. Je n'ai rien compris. Uh, I didn't understand anything. Right, il me semble que vous comprenez tout. I didn't understand anything. Il n'a rien fait. He didn't do anything. Very good. He didn't do anything. He didn't do anything. Ils n'ont rien acheté. Um, they didn't buy anything. Very good. They didn't buy anything. Vous ne trouverez rien. Uh, you uh, didn't find uh, 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 anything. You didn't find anything. Vous n'avez rien trouvé. Mais comment dites-vous Vous ne trouverez rien. Ah, uh, um, you won't find anything. Right. Once more. You won't find anything. Right. You won't find anything. You won't find anything. You will not find anything. You won't find anything. Parce que je l'ai bien caché. <laughs> je n'ai rien. Uh, I uh, don't have anything. Right. <laughs> I don't have anything. Je ne peux pas le trouver. I can't find it. Yes, I can't find it. Ou sans la contraction. I cannot find it. I cannot find it. Yes. Il peut le faire. He can do it. Right. He can do it. Pouvez-vous me dire? Can you tell me? Right. Can you tell me? Comment dit-on? Je ne peux pas vous comprendre. I can't understand you. Yes, I can't understand you. Ou I cannot understand 